Welcome to Johnny's Best, and I'm playing Mini Metro. Let's see how many people we can bring on the subway. Let's go to Paris. Play. Okay, so the idea is connect people from these different subway lines here, from these different uh, locations. So I have this yellow line. It's going to pick up people and deliver them to these three areas. Let's speed up the game here in the corner. Make it a little trickier. And uh, this cart can hold six people. And any shape that they are, these people, like this circle guy here, who wants to go to any circle location. Ooh. See, the problem here is I only have two bridges extra remaining. I don't want to have to use a lot of bridges here. In fact, what I might do is go like this and go like this. That way, we only use one bridge. So this will be my main line here, this yellow line. Oh, look at that. Problem is you don't want it to be zigzagging all over the place because then it takes this guy 30 years to get to work. Yeah, he doesn't want to spend all day fumbling around the whole city just to get there. I kind of want to connect this, but I don't want to use an extra bridge for it. And at the end of the week, we're on week two, you get a new locomotive and one of these two things you can choose. I'm going to choose a carriage, which makes one of my trains longer. Whoops, didn't drop it there. There we go. Now, this this guy, this train can hold 12 people. Oh, look at this. Now, I'm going to use a second line here and connect it to here and here. It uses up one of my trains. And there's my other line. Whoopsie. I accidentally activated another line, the brown line, which maybe I will use here. I have another bridge unit, so let's go here, here, here. I like that. Look at that. Okay, so that line, although we need all people that want to go to the plus location will need to hitch a ride on this dark green line. So let's connect it to the yellow there. Yeah, you can see this guy needs to get picked up if he wants to get here. Oh, there's so many new locations popping up. I'm not sure if our trains can handle this kind of load. Locomotive, and let's do another carriage. And let's add this carriage to the green line. This is going to be doing a lot of work. And let's add another locomotive to... The yellow line has two going already. How about the, the blue line? Yeah, let's put it in the blue line. <laughs> Actually, let's not put it in the blue line. Um, how do I get rid of this guy? Let me try and pause him in the game when he's moving. Can I grab that guy? I don't know how to grab him. I got him. I think the yellow line needs more help. I was a bit crazy there earlier. Okay, let's go. I love I love the simple strategy of this game. It, it's uh, it's it's simplistic style is is actually uh very appealing to me, and it's fun. It's fun and it gets hairy too real quick. I like the the speed how it ramps up very quickly. So the score here, I have 190 people um, that I've transported to different locations, and that's essentially my score. So it just, it just keeps going up as you deliver people to their to their stops, to their destinations. All right, let's connect this and the yellow line to this. This is a rare one, locomotive, and let's do a ooh, let's do a carriage. Let's do a carriage. Let's add it to the blue. And let's add a locomotive to the green. Yeah, I'm glad I added it to the blue, because the blue's getting a lot more work now. This is a lot of people here to pick up. Whew. A lot of work. In fact, just the one train kind of concerns me. Like, this is really starting to fill up. If any of these fill up with people for too long, you lose the game. Ooh. This zigzag 
Like, who wants to do this to get downtown? Like, just, oh, what's going on? This is the weirdest zigzag ever. Oh, a diamond location. Uh-oh. Oh, no. The blue line is in big trouble now. Okay. I'm going to wait till Sunday. Then we get a new cart. I'm going to add add it to the blue line. Oh, look at this. See, this is what I'm saying. This, this is the countdown. If that builds up too much and it goes a full circle, boom, you lose. Wow. Okay. Oh, is yellow going to survive? Is the yellow line going to survive? We have three cars. I guess it's just so big. Let's connect it. Locomotive. Actually, let's get... Uh, no. Two tunnels. I just, I've, I've lost for not having the right amount of tunnels in the past. Maybe if I'm connecting that, it'll make it easier. I'm hoping this connection here it can just go in a nice circle. It'll really alleviate a lot of the problems that I'm having here. That's my hope. And I wanted to add another train to this blue line because it is just zigzagging all over the place. Oh boy. Yellow? Yellow's already suffering though. Oh, no, let's make it yellow. Blue is just such a gross zigzag. It's just all over the place. Yeah, okay, because blue has this added to it. Oh, another one. Oh, blue's in trouble. These two lo locations on blue are shared by different trains, so I feel like that's okay. You can see a lot of tra uh, transfer points here. All these trains drop off for green and yellow to pick up to get to here. Actually, ugh. It's a problem because only green can get to the plus. <sighs> Locomotive and a carriage. Let's add a carriage to the blue. And let's add a car to yellow. There, now yellow and green can stop here. Oh, look at this. Oh, no. No, it's not gonna make it. It's not gonna make it. Oh no! Oh, come on! Get there! Oh! Oh, there it is. 659 passengers. That's not bad. 38 days. You know what? It, it's a tough game. It's a tough little game. Johnny's Best playing Mini Metro. Thanks for watching. Hit the like and subscribe buttons if you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to turn on notifications to get updates on new videos. Leave a comment so I know what you liked. And again, thanks so much for watching.